It's late, guys, but when does that ever stop a good news reporter? This is Daz's Hot Comic Book Alerts, episode 205, as you know the score. Please tell me you do. News waits for no man. What have I got for you? An image, like I often start. And if you know what this image is, the book in question, you're a better person than I am. There's the image, folks. An obscure, low-printed book. But well, Disney is moving forward with a movie adaptation of Cullen Bunn and Vanessa R. Del Rey's The Empty Man, setting it for an August 7th, 2020 release date, and that's according to Variety. Now, Iron Man 3's James Badge was announced in 2016 as the movie's lead, with David Pryor set to write and direct. It's been one year since the first reported case of the empty man disease, and no drug has been able to slow its progress, reads Boone's description of the original series. The cause is unknown, and the symptoms include fits of rage, hideous hallucinations, suicidal dementia, followed by death, or a near lifeless empty state of catatonia. Now, as murder cults rise nationwide, the FBI and CDC enter a joint investigation of the empty man, hoping to piece together clues to stop the cult and uncover a cure. Now, the empty man was originally optioned by 20th Century Fox back in 2016, the first project signed from Fox's first look deal with Boom Studios. Now, the empty man is one of several Boom adaptations Disney inherited as part of its acquisition of 20th the 21st Century Fox. Now, two other Boom Fox adaptations, Mouse Guard, as we know, and Lumberjanes, were cancelled by Disney. So, we're getting an Empty Man movie. Now, there are two volumes of The Empty Man. One that came out in 2014, and one that came out in 2018. And I pulled the trigger earlier today, and I got number one of the second volume. So go careful what you're looking for. I only paid a few couple of quid for it, so I'm not stung too badly. But even that book is now flying off of eBay. If you don't believe me, check eBay right now. The Empty Man from Boom Studios is flying. So initially, the series was from 2014. It was a six issue mini series, guys. And Issue one is the, the money book, and there are five different covers for it. We will start with the regular cover, and this is from Vanessa R. Del Rey. This is the book to be on the lookout for, guys. On eBay currently, the cheapest one you're going to find is about 30 quid. And this is it, guys. The Empty Man, issue number one from Boom Studios going to be a movie that's the regular cover then we have the more sought after cover the image i just showed you this is an incentive goni montez virgin variant cover this is the money book this is a 20 dollar book on comic book round i can't even find one on ebay at the moment like i say it's an incentive then up next we have the c cover which is a cards comics and collectibles exclusive this is a $10 book on Comic Book Run. Following on from that, we have the D cover, which is a second printing. Okay, so go careful. A second printing Scott Newman variant cover. And finally, we have the E cover, which is a San Diego Comic Con exclusive Vanessa R. Del Rey variant cover. A striking cover this one I like this one okay so like I said that's volume one now there is a volume two and that started in November of 2018 and it's still going now I have just picked up issue one this is the book I've just paid for a couple of quid but look at it on eBay guys this one is flying now as well do well to get that for under 10 so, be on the lookout, guys. Empty Man is coming from Boom Studios. Get into those dollar boxes. 
See what gold you can unearth. Don't let me down. That's Daz Overnight. Bye for now.